I'm your Cape Coral Community Correspondent, Colton Chavez, and I am here for National Boating and Fishing Week, where go ahead and take a look behind me. That's Robin, and she's a member of the Freedom Boat Club, and she says this is one of her favorite parts about getting on the water because it makes boating accessible for anyone. But why would I sit here and just watch her have all the fun? I'm gonna get out there with her. But now we're starting to get out and explore more. We've been up to North Captiva and... Robin Silvestri says she's always lived a life on the water, even when her family lived up north in New York. We lived on our boat for months at a time. Uh, moving down to Florida, the Freedom Boat Club allowed us to have access to a boat. And giving more women in Cape Coral access to boating is what the Freedom Boat Club says they're pushing to do. I think people are surprised to see more women on the water. Um, we always get a lot of waves when we're out here, you know, not waves from the water, but waves from other boaters. And catching those waves on the Gulf Coast for Robin. Come on, we need to see a dolphin. Boating on the water in Southwest Florida is, is really taking advantage of the paradise that we live in. And she hopes her story will give more women the desire to be the captains of their own ships. I love to take my girls out and just have a girls day out on the water. Reporting from the Gulf Coast. Seeing the dolphins never gets old. Colton Chavez. Fox 4.